guys, what's up? Um, I went herping earlier today, and, hold on a sec, right. and, uh, I took a different road than usual, I usually go on a, uh, the main road, but instead I went off on a dirt road, I like this one because it's got a stream that longs the long side of it, and, uh, usually I find some leopard frogs, musk turtles, and stuff like that, but this time I found some bullfrogs, and, uh, I managed to catch one of them, the other ones kind of got away. Um, I followed where this one went. It's actually considered a juvenile still. They get a whole a hell of a lot bigger than this. Um, if you look at Herb Keeper's channel, um, he just caught a big old bullfrog. Um, I think it was the other day, but yeah. This is a lot smaller than the one he caught. I gotta keep it wet, so I got a bucket of water over here. Um, yeah, this is an amphibian, um, like all frogs, but this is actually a true frog. Um, tree frogs are considered, um, or not tree frogs, but uh, there's some kinds of frogs that aren't considered true frogs. I'm not sure. They don't have a ridge alongside of the belly. Um, so yeah, um, she's a decent, decent size. Um, you, the way you can tell the difference between male and female is the female, she has smaller eardrums like so they're the same size as the eye but the males they have a larger eardrum um, so that's a good uh, way to identify the male from female and the belly is a cream white with black blotches on it and um, um, the body is a gray color with um, and the snout area is a lime green almost so, um, there's a couple frogs that are mistaken for them, like the pig frog and just the green frog, the common green frog. And, um, on their, uh, legs, they have stripes from, uh, the juvenile stage. So, I'm pr pretty sure this is still a juvenile. And, um, you can tell they're aquatic by their webbed feet. Well, there's his eyes poked up. They're really cute looking. And, um, these, I'm not sure if they're native or not. They're, they're introduced in a lot of places across the U.S. And, um, so it's possible that this could be, um, um, an invasive or not even a non-native species. Uh, bullfrogs are really invasive. The females can have up to 25,000 eggs, large females. Um, this is a female. She could probably have about 10, 15,000 maybe. Uh, it's still a lot because seeing as most of the eggs actually survive, um, some predators like raccoons and foxes will actually feed on the eggs and stuff. So, uh, but what they, uh, what the one, the ones that get eaten, they uh, make up in numbers because they have thousands of eggs. So there's really no chance of any predator eating them all completely. Um, yeah, so they're really cute. Uh, I like bullfrogs. Um, yeah, they jump, they're powerful jumpers, really champ, they're just champions at the jumping. Um, they can, this one can jump like six or seven feet in just one leap, um, which is amazing. Um, the large specimens can jump up to ten feet, which is really cool. Um, uh, yeah, they got really smooth skin and they, uh, secrete a slimy mucus to uh, ward off predators and also to keep their skin moist. Uh, that's what uh, he or she did when I first picked her up. And uh, I'm gonna show you guys putting her in a bucket soon because uh, this is where I've been keeping her for uh, for uh, since I've got her. And um, so yeah, they're just really cute. Um, got huge bulbous eyes, and these things will eat almost anything. They'll eat uh, insects, fish, turtles, small turtles, um, depending on their size. They'll eat rodents, they'll eat snakes, um, other frogs. That's my cat down there. Um, they just eat a lot of things. Uh, and that's why they mainly get their size. Um, it's from the uh, their intake. They just eat everything they come across. And these things are actually sit and wait. They'll actually wait for something to walk by and they'll just launch their tongue out at it. So, yeah, they're really awesome. Maybe you'll turn into a princess if I kiss you. No, I'm joking. But yeah, bullfrogs actually have teeth too. Really small teeth. So, 
Yeah, um, really cute. Um, so yeah, I don't have much more to tell you. I'm just gonna show you me putting her in the. Well, let me get a grip on it. Here's the bucket of water I had her. So yeah, that's the oh, that's the American bullfrog. Um, it's really common. Really, really common. So, yeah, um, hope you guys enjoyed this video, and uh, until next time, I'll see ya.